Hi everyone, Chris here. So we do have driver updates now coming through for specific mobile phones. Now Qualcomm, they are pushing out updates for the Adreno 650, or will be two manufacturers. Xiaomi is one of the first, I believe, or the first, to actually let us have and test out and install the driver update. But it's only on three devices so far. So we're talking about Chinese phones here that at least do come with English. So this is the Redmi K30 Pro, which I happen to be holding right here, the Mi 10 and the Mi 10 Pro. Now the Mi 10 and the Mi 10 Pro have been released internationally. We've got global versions, but at the time of publishing this video here, there is no method or way to get it. You need to actually jump onto the Mi App Store in China. I'll show you how to do that in this video. So it's not actually that easy to find it. We need to put in a certain phrase, search term to bring that up because it's all in Chinese. And I'll go through step by step to install that update and also show you the performance difference before and after we update the drivers, which apparently improves performance, stability, Vulkan driver updates and OpenGL updates just to enhance gaming and the gaming experience. That is actually mentioned in the change log. Now before we get into this, I wanna point this out that this does not work on the global version of the Mi 10 or the Mi 10 Pro. It doesn't work on other Snapdragon 865 devices yet. You need to look to the manufacturer for those updates being published to their own stores, I think, or maybe later in Google Play. So this is the K30 Pro that I'm going to install the driver on here. And you need to be on the Chinese ROM. So if you happen to have, say, the Chinese version of the phone, but you flashed over, say, a different ROM, Xiaomi EU ROM, then you're going to need the Mi Store on here, the Chinese Mi Store APK. If you can somehow sideload it, you'll get that, get that APK file, put it on your phone, and I've jumped into it here. So first up, I did run into a bit of a problem, and that was I couldn't find the app in here. If you type GPU, the search system in this thing is just ridiculous. You type GPU up here, it would come up with all these different applications, none of them the one that we actually want. So you need to find the one that looks like this, GPU. Now, here's a hint. This is how I found it. I spent actually a long time searching for it. So jump into... Google Translate, okay? Run it for driver update, get the text there for Chinese. So you just wanna search it in Chinese. Copy and paste that, jump back into the Mi store, okay? Then search that Chinese text. Search the Chinese, then you will see it. Okay, and when you get into it, the app, it's gonna tell us here, GPU upgrade, upgrade here for the Adreno 630, K30 Pro, and it supports the Mi 10 and the Mi 10 Pro there, enhancing our GPU performance. Now, I have translated roughly the change log. I use Google, Google Translate to check it out, and it's telling us that we have got fully released the potential of the GPU to continuously improve gaming experience. Okay, this is the main functions. Optimize the GPU driver to enhance performance and stability, game performance and stability. And it's just saying that it only, this long here, supports the Mi 10 and the Mi 10 Pro and the K30 Pro, all right. And it's the OpenGL optimization and Vulkan optimization, published today, the time of filming this video here, April the 30th, and it says A, this is the A650 for, of course, the Adreno 650, all right. And installing it is so simple. You just tap here, you tap the install, it will take, a little while to do it, maybe three minutes or something like that, and now installed. So that is it. There is actually no APK file, unfortunately. I searched all the folders inside the phone. I tried to find something for you guys that I could somehow get and share an APK file that everyone can install on their particular Xiaomi Snapdragon 865 phone. So even the Black Shark, which I have here, this is the Black Shark 3 Pro gaming phone with the same exact chipset, Snapdragon 865, both of these I searched. Nothing. So they don't have the GPU driver update yet, which is unfortunate. So I have also run here and Tutu. This is just a before and after that I'm going to do, okay? So this is the before score for and Tutu. Keep an eye on the GPU benchmarks there, the synthetic benchmarks. So the Terracotta one is Vulcan and also Coastline is Vulcan. So keep an eye on those scores there. I'll take a screenshot of this as well to show you once I run it again. Refinery is OpenGL. So now I'm gonna reboot the phone. This is important because we need those new drivers to take when it boots up, okay? All those library files that went over, they're the updated files, so the reboot is necessary. So I'm gonna reboot now. I'll run Antutu again, and we'll see if it has improved that GPU performance. 
So it's just about to finish up, 99%, and we'll take a look at the difference. Uh, hopefully this score has gone up significantly, but I don't... Oh, actually, that's quite a nice increase, isn't it? For nothing, for just a driver update. So here's the old score again. This is before the GPU driver update, and now after that GPU driver update. So we gained 7,206 points which is 3.3% more GPU performance here. Hey, that's not bad from just a driver update, and that's kind of to be expected. Will you actually notice this difference, though? Absolutely not when gaming. It is only going to be visible in synthetic benchmarks like this one here. All right, so there we go. It's not a significant update at all you can see there. But you can do this if you haven't had the Chinese versions. Now, I know a lot of people are going to ask me, hey, Chris, where's the APK file? Why are you not sharing it with us? Why is no one sharing it? It's the way that the Mi Store is installing it that I'm not actually able to grab an APK file here. I'm not seeing it. It's just going through with those library driver update files, putting all that into the system there. And there's no way for me to actually share this with you yet. Maybe some developer out there knows how to do that, but that's something I haven't messed around with yet, of course. I don't even have the bootloader unlocked on the particular model I have here, the K30 Pro. So sadly, nothing for the Mi 10 and the Mi 10 Pro global versions, but I do expect that Xiaomi should be pushing that driver update in English once they've translated it, maybe tested it first with the Chinese market into the global Mi App Store there, and maybe eventually into Google Play, Qualcomm will just do a general release. The tech that someone has, the Snapdragon 865, and go, hey, driver update available, push it through, improve the performance there. So it is good to see that Qualcomm is doing this, and Xiaomi, of course, jumping on and pushing this out to everyone out there. So if I do get hold of an APK file, I will put the link down in the description of this video. I'm currently working on the review, the full review of this one right here, which is the Redmi K30 Pro, if you are interested in that and waiting. It should be very soon in the channel, so check and look out for that. And thank you for watching this quick, short GPU driver update video here. Hopefully it was helpful to you, especially those guys with the Chinese versions of these phones.